Um, our next speaker um, will share with you a very short presentation on an app that uh, we have developed, the Purple Vest app. Um, Shelly uh, Rom is uh, the head of our international uh, uh, activities. Um, my right hand on everything we're doing here. Uh, Shelly, please. Thank you. So, hello everyone. I'm Shelly. I'm in my mid-30s. I have a brown, full, puffy hair. And I wear a black shirt. And behind me there is the purple vest. So today we're going to talk a little bit about the Purple Vest app, but this is something that has started, the idea started before, because every emergency, people with disabilities has, have unique needs. When we did, the Access Israel team did the Purple Vest survey at the beginning of the war in Israel, we talked about needs and challenges of people with disabilities during emergencies. And people with disabilities talked about challenges like access to medicine, access to food, accessible transportation, medical supplies. All of these things are things that were during this time provided by volunteers. And when we started seeing what's going on on ground, where people you know, with physical disabilities told us, I can't leave my house. There is a grocery stores, store 200 meters from my house. But if there is a siren, I can't go anywhere. I can't defend myself. Or if a person were evacuated from his home with his kids, and all, all he wanted to do was leave home and he left in such a rush that he forgot to take clothes. He didn't think about the fact that he doesn't know how long he will stay outside of his home. So what do I do in terms of entertainment for the kids or alternative education for the kids? They need computers. Some kids were in need of tablets to communicate for communication. And we started working on essential needs for people with disabilities and their families. We trained hundreds of volunteers all over the country for assisting people with disabilities, for communicating with them. And then whenever a need was rising, and there was hundreds of them, we wrote on a WhatsApp group to the volunteers that we train, go do help, this person needs help, this person needs help. And then we thought there must be a better way. Technology is on our side. So we approached Code for Israel, which is a great organization who, who helps with social challenges by technology solution. And they started developing for us the Purple Vest app. The idea of the Purple Vest app is to connect the people with disabilities who has unique needs during emergencies with the volunteers directly. I will share screen so I will show you. We will launch this app very soon. The idea is this. You enter the app. If you are a volunteer, you will see the needs. If you're a person who is in need of help, you can fill out a form. If I need clothing, for example, I will fill out the form and I will put on the information I need. Okay, I need clothes for my one-year-old. And I need it as soon as possible. I will go to the next step and I will fill out my details and this app is now a web app so it's in hebrew and we translated it online on web and this need that i raised in the app just got into the database so if i am a volunteer i will go and i will see all of the volunteer options that are 
available, all of the requests, and I can filter them by location, by the type of need that I can assist with. And if I want to assist, for example, in transportation, I will take this, I will be happy to assist, and it will show up in my volunteer log, and I can do it. I will have all the details of the person who is in need of help, and I will be able to assist him. So this is the first phase of the app. The second thing will be that a lot of the needs of people with disabilities during emergency are due to loneliness. So a body for crisis is something else that we're working on, matching people who will assist, who will contact whenever an emergency occurs to see that the person has all the things that he needs and that is safe. And if he needs anything else, I will be the person who will assist him. So that's basically the idea. And I want to thank you. I'm trying to keep up with the time. So I want to thank you for listening. And if you want more information, and of course, this could be adjusted to every country in every language, then you can definitely contact us. Thank you so much. Thank you, Shelley. Thank you very much.